Have we really seen the last of jetpacks in Call of Duty World War II? Find out next. What is up guys? It is your boy B7 Chacalon. In today's video, we're going to be talking about Call of Duty World War II and the jetpacks. Alright, in the jetpacks. So, if you didn't know, um, like a couple of months ago before the release of the reveal trailer or after the reveal trailer of Call of Duty World War II, we got, you know, we were very excited. I mean, we were literally excited and a lot of people, no, uh, in the live stream, Michael Condry and, you know, the co-founders of his of Sledgehammer, they said that this game will be literally set in the past, which is World War II, and it's going to be a fully traditional boots in the ground Call of Duty, and which is really exciting to be honest with you. I mean, who doesn't want to play some boots in the ground Call of Duty, right? I mean, we don't want to see some, we don't want to play some remaster all like Modern Warfare remaster. So, and you know, after the live stream, a lot of people were tweeting, you know, how excited they were. And, but there were also people who were tweeting about how there could be jetpacks in Call of Duty World War II. Because during the World War II, uh, I don't know who made the jetpacks, but they were literally like there was jetpacks during World War II. And it was possible. I mean... And it is crazy, right, how uh, there were eight, I mean, I don't know the people, I heard that it was um, Germany or something, I don't even know. Uh, they they pretty much created like a jetpack, alright? Like, it was possible and there was a jetpack in World War Two, Not like in the game, but you know, I'm talking about like the history, you know. There was actually jetpacks. Uh, and during the World War Two, and that is crazy, right? And a lot of people were like, "Well, how? Well, what if? You know, Sledgehammer literally puts jetpacks in World War Two in this game because <laughs> you know they're trying to make this game very identical to what happened, you know, during the World War Two era and what guns." the maps and pretty much almost everything and you know a lot of people were like I mean could we get jetpacks because there were jetpacks uh, made you know during World War II so will that even be possible that's what a lot of people you know were pretty much arguing I will say but yeah and it's pretty crazy I mean really like do you really think there's going to be jetpacks I mean Hell no, it's not going to happen. Uh, you know, a lot of people were like, yes, jetpacks were in World War II. So could, uh, could a sledgehammer, you know, do something or like implement a jetpack, you know, in this game? And that will be like the biggest troll ever. I mean, who would have won jetpacks in this game? I know I wouldn't. I mean, I want a boots in the ground, Call of Duty, no jetpacks none of the stuff i mean it's just crazy like i could just imagine in this game people jumping around it will be just really annoying and dumb in my opinion i mean if it's like putting in <clears throat> it's like putting jetpacks or like hacks in world war ii like no world at war the game that came out in 2008 by treyarch like it will just look dumb right I mean, the game itself is just incredible, and by putting jetpacks as a kill streak or as a perk, it will just look dumb. I mean, you never know, you know, because there was a time where uh, before Modern Warfare 3 came out, a lot of people didn't like lasting, and guess what? Guess what they did in Modern Warfare 3? Uh, the, um, I don't know, the co-founders, I don't even know who they were. Like the community managers, they said that we will not have lasting in Modern Warfare 3. But when the game came out, there was final stand or like, yeah, there was final stand 
and pretty much it was lasting right and the same thing and they just literally lied to the community and i don't think this is going to happen and th i mean there's there's no way that we can get freaking jetpacks in the next call of duty i mean there's no way i mean a lot of people like don't like jetpacks in the future they call of duties you know with the advanced movement and stuff like that and it is pretty much impossible to get jetpacks in the next call of duty but you know you, you you don't even you never know you never know but by the co-founders you know michael conjuring all these people saying that you know that we will this game will be literally boots in the ground no matter what and there's not going to be no jetpacks and futuristic advanced movement then that pretty much pretty much 100 percent proves that we will not get in jetpacks and you know it will just really be really dumb to add you know jetpacks in this game and a lot of people are saying that jetpacks were in world war ii during the world war ii it was there you know and you know sledgehammer could actually put jetpacks in this game but in my opinion i don't think it's going to happen and it will never happen uh, in my opinion in the next few call of duties i mean the community is really tired of the advanced movement and futuristic you know team and so we are good to go i mean this is literally infinite warfare is the last time we will see probably jetpacks ever to be honest with you i mean after the past three years activision is not really you know satisfied with the sales and everything so uh, there's no way in hell we're gonna be getting jetpacks in the next few call of duties you know it's just crazy so yeah guys that was it for the video hope you guys enjoyed it give me a thumbs up if you did and of course peace out